so what we're about to create here now is the linen denim decorative painting technique. In order to do the linen denim look, you're going to want to watch the dragging stray portion of the video. Now that portion of the video will bring you right up to where we're starting now. To continue on to get the linen denim look, you're going to want to let your first surface dry. Once it's completely dried, then you're going to want to take a level. And this is a tool that we use to get vertical lines. And you're going to mark every 36 inches approximately on your wall. Make a little mark every 36 inches. Then you're going to take the level and you're going to hold it on that mark, making sure that the bubble's center, and that's going to give you a perfectly level vertical line. Take a pencil and make a line going all the way down your wall. And you're going to want to do this over right here too as well. So I'll just do that. Now once we've made our marks every 36 inches on the wall, we'll go ahead and take blue low adhesion masking tape. What blue tape is, is it's tape that's designed specifically to go on walls that won't remove the pre-existing base coat colors. So I'm going to take my blue masking tape and tape on either side of the pencil marks that I've put on the wall, running completely from top to bottom. You'll want to do this all the way around the room. That way you can go ahead and start the glazing process to create the linen denim look. So what we've done here is we've applied the masking tape every 36 inches upon the wall. What we've also done is we took the masking tape and applied an X every other section. This section that has no X on it, that's the section we're going to be working to create the linen denim look. Now to continue this on, we are actually going to be creating the same type of look that we did to get the dragging strie look, except for this time we're going to move in a horizontal fashion. Again, we'll load up our roller with glaze and take the woolly and I'm actually going to apply my glaze in a horizontal pattern. Again, being conscious that our glaze is going on nice and even and smooth and we want to apply it in a wide enough area wider than the woolly. Then we're going to go ahead and take the woolly and it's okay if you work left to right or right to left whatever you're comfortable with and you're going to drag through the woolly. Now you might create some wavering as you travel across the surface but that's okay because linen and denim weaves actually do have a waver to them. When you get to the end again you take the woolly wipe off the excess glaze and continue on. Well now we've created this panel. And when we've finished, we'll go ahead and lift our, lift our, our masking tape. We're going to let this surface dry completely. When it's completely dry, we'll apply masking tape on this side of the pencil line and do the same look in panels all the way around the room. So thank you for watching this instructional video on linen and denim and have fun faux finishing.